I'm Dr. Derek Sakata. I'm a clinical anesthesiologist at the University of Utah. Today, I'm going to show you how to use the vapor clean filters in an actual MH crisis. If you suspect that your patient may have triggered into an MH crisis, it's important to realize that you need to curtail the amount of triggering the agent that the patient has or continuing to receive. The first thing you want to do is make sure that you follow the MHA US guidelines and get Ryanodex or Dantrolene on as quickly as possible. In addition to that, to decrease the amount of triggering agent that your patient is exposed to, turn off the anesthetic immediately, turn your fresh gas flows up to greater than 10 liters per minute, remove your existing breathing circuit and your bag, then place your vapor clean filters one on the inspiratory side, one on the expiratory side. Replace the circuit with a new breathing circuit. And a new bag. Okay. With the vapor clean in place, you have now curtailed your patient's exposure to a triggering agent. When used in this manner, the vapor clean is good for one hour. If the case should last longer than one hour, we recommend having a second pair of vapor clean filters to replace these filters at the one hour mark. For that reason, we recommend having two pairs of vapor clean filters on your MH card to handle any such emergency. Contact us for more information.